Hi, I'm Patrick. This specific video is in the series of video I'm re releasing, basically focusing on CMAT strategy and tip. So today I'll be focusing on strategy for the content and the logic section. Normally what happens in these two sections is uh, people go overboard. What do I mean is that when they start solving, they don't realize the time. They feel, oh, there is a lot of time or the paper is easy and so on and so forth. And they spend a lot of time maybe on the individual question which ensures that uh, they are not able to finish the section on time and will affect the overall paper. I normally recommend that at least in these two sections try to solve the paper in two round strategy. That means suppose I am giving one hour for my con section. So that means I will try to complete the first round maybe in around 40 to 45 minutes where I will go to the entire question, solve whatever I can solve easily, skip, skip whatever is difficult. So that means uh, if I'm going to solve from 25, if I'm able to solve most of the question first round, I'll finish it in 40, 45 minutes. And then I'll come back to those questions which I've left, which I felt difficult. Now, what, how does this help? Basically, it helps because it ensures that you don't waste your time on a very difficult question or a question, maybe it could be wrong or for some other reason. I mean, I've seen students just wasting a lot of time on an individual question, which affects the entire paper. Then that should not happen. So it's always advisable to form a two round strategy and more important in the puzzle section, the logic section, where it is easy to, you know, waste your time on a particular question. You start solving, you feel you'll get the answer, you feel you'll get the answer, but you don't get the answer. Okay. And you've wasted a lot of time. And even if you get the answer after wasting a lot of time, it may not be worth it. So therefore it is advisable that both for the content and the logic section have a two round strategy. Your first round, the timing will depend upon how much, I mean, how many questions you found in the solve in the first round. If you solve most of the question in the first round, then give your first round as around 40 to 45 minutes, maybe even 50 minutes. Okay. If you're going to solve less number of questions in the first round, maybe you can give less time, like half an hour for the first round. That depends on your strategy, how it goes, right? But do have a two round strategy, but for both the content and the logic section. And this is what I normally do for my CAT examination, other exams. So I can go through all the easy questions. Don't waste time on the first round on a tough question. I normally come back to the tougher question and I'm able to solve it in a much peaceful mind and get the answer. Right? Try it out. I think it's a good idea to do about it. Ensure that you form a proper strategy before you go for the exam for each of the section that is there with proper time limits and try to maintain the time limits. Understand we don't know how the paper is. Don't try to predict the paper. The paper could be easy. The paper could be tough. I mean, there have been cases where the paper have been tough. There have been cases where the paper have been very easy. So go with the open mind, but have a proper strategy in place when you write the exam. That is very important. Right? I hope this helps. All the best. Thank you.